All right, we're here at Fitness Fight Factory. I'm going to show you how to escape the neon belly in an unorthodox way, but it takes a low amount of energy. And then I'm going to go into some foot locks and passes real quick, okay? And then an escape to the foot lock. So Levi has me a neon belly. He's on top of me. And especially like when he has his hand at my hip, I do this a lot. Like guys will go to side control. Guys will pop up from side control and push him on the hip and that arm's back here. I use my knee to come inside this space right here. And I, and I literally just blocking his arm. I can block it like this. I could block it like this. And I drop my left knee to the mat and it sweeps him over. Oh, okay. Now his leg is exposed here. So I'm able to wrap it up right here, okay? And I'm gonna posture up, I hook the leg and I bring my foot back. Make sure that I'm not reaping right now because we're doing it like uh, without reaping, okay? So my, my heel's in, I'm not like this, my heel's in and my knees are pinched. I make sure I'm on the end of this foot and when I grab the foot lock, you, can, you like to do it like this, that's great. I like to do it like a Marcelo team grip, it's like a guillotine grip, right? And I crunch my shoulder and my elbow tight, but then I'm doing an oblique crunch, like, so I'm crunching sideways, so I'm going this way. Oh, many taps. Different than when we have the foot on the bottom side and we're trying to belly down. It's a different movement, I'm doing a side crunch, bang, like that. Okay, so essentially, like what I'm saying is on shoulder to hip, I'm going sideways, that's the movement. Okay, let's go again. So he's got me in the on belly. He may have, actually let's back up. He may have, stand up. He may have come around the corner from when I had spider drum. Maybe I was like this and neon belly. He comes in and he's neon belly. Same thing, so I can knock him right over. His, foot, his foot's right here, I prop up. I make sure I got the ankle. I tighten it up on the ankle when I get there. I grab the, the guillotine grip. I'm on the end of the foot. My knees are pinched past his knee. I'm not like this, I'm here. Now I can arch towards his knee and tap him. But Levi can show the escape. You want to show the escape? Yeah. All right. So when he's here, no matter how strong his pinches, his inside thigh muscles, okay, that open that way, are not going to be as strong as my hamstrings and quads going forward like we're walking. All right. So I want to get my hips in line. I make sure I come up on my hand. Okay. I come up. I throw my leg over. And now it's like I'm walking. I'm stomping his leg out. Okay. I walk up on my hands and go right back to me on belly, okay? I'll actually keep him towards his side, and I have his arm trapped with my, with my legs now. His arm's stuck, I can work on chokes from here, okay? Just right there, knee on bit. there you go. And it sends him right away. All right, escape, come up, get my hips in line, come over the top, stomp his leg away. Walk my hands forward, come up. I'm on his ribs, it's a lot of pressure, and I'm trapping his arm, I can work on chokes.